Greetings and salutations, I'm Kev, welcome back to this let's play of EU4 as Spain. So, I've been looking around on the map for potential victims, and I'm thinking we just might pursue uh, a little neighboring conflict over here. Because they seem to be the only ones we can declare war on without much problems. Uh, did we go and siege this one? Yeah, we did. So, it's gonna be fine. Yeah, Russia's gonna murder everything here. That's kind of to be expected. Whoa, what's Italy doing? Interesting. Oh, for Pete's sake. That's a lot of colonial assemblies. What's triggering these now? Oh, I didn't realize that my mercantilism is actually increasing their liberty desire. Huh. Interesting. Yeah, these guys are far more rebellious now than I used to. Um... The problem is the second one of them uh, goes over the limit. Uh, this is going to be a problem. Okay, which of them was the most rebellious? That's Claudius and... No, it's not. Augustus, Claudius. Augustus is up here. kind of detriment with me or something. I did, but that's fine. Send one, one. Send one diplomat over oh, to fix that. So the other one's gonna be, yeah, let's keep the other one free. But yeah, they're certainly becoming rebellious. Ah, for... Stop being so effective. At least they will be gone in a couple of years. You know that. Um, yeah, we're gonna stay at peace until I get that, until we core everything. Then I just might try to threaten a few wars. Because I believe they would yield, most of them. Say, would you yield? Yes. Would you yield? I threat for Salent, you would. I know I need Salent, don't need anything. Oh, again. Well, I don't need a statesman, but I'll happily take the different points so I can keep converting provinces. Oh, probably sound something converted. Something in Italy? No. Yeah, let's go with Keep going the coast here. It's a bit much. Don't need a trader. Yeah, we'll just cool our heels for a bit. I mean, we do have quite a lot of aggressive expansion. Just about everywhere. Oh! You joined Venice's trade league. That's interesting. That is very interesting. I 
everybody has problems. Come on, finish the siege. We have other rebels to deal with. I s oh, I'm gonna keep the diplomat for you. You never know what we suddenly need a diplomat for. Okay, there we go. Siege is done. Pick up the troops. Deal with the next, next rebellion. Build up our manpower so we can fight uh, Milan and friends later. Let's see, no rebellions here. You managed to deal with that. No rebellion up there. Okay, I guess this is it. That's roughly where we want our army anyway, so... Of course, that depends. Have you managed to finish coring everything? No, you haven't. Are you coring it? Yes, you are. And the entire British army is over here. It's gonna be painful if we ever go to war with them, but then again we can just they'll have pretty much free reign back home. Let's have a look. Yeah, Russia has a tremendous army. And that is the pretty much the entire force of England. Huh. Yeah, we'll take our time. Quell rebellions. Convert provinces. Uh, is that a... Okay, let's see. Tire some fish. Leave it be. It's a drylands province. I don't really care about the fort. It's also drylands, but it's more of a fish. What are you doing? Um. Hmm. Purge of heresy against Baden. This is not the war I wanted right now. At all. But, uh, let's see. How are we going to do this? First of all, let's go to the regions. Okay, Alsace is part of Germany. But these provinces are part of France, so I need these, these three provinces. Okay, next up is the... Diplomatic feedback for me. Put these at extreme inter extremely interesting. Get our troops into position. This is kind of annoying because I was planning to extort these from Lorraine, but now we're going to get a truce with them. Who else are in this? Ulm, Memmingen, Baden. They all come to the aid, right? Yes. Tad annoying. We could... Let's see, I assume I can threaten war before the war starts. No. Dang it, they thought of that. Boo! <laughs> okay. Hmm. Let's see, Loran is reformed, so I shouldn't get too much trouble if they give me land. I don't think they'll ever do that. So, sure. 
all join. And send the leaders over here, I suppose. Uh, that will be you. It's the battle leader. You're the siege tactician. Get there. Uh, the fleet. Don't go there, go here. I mean, our only interest in this conflict is uh, Lorraine. Really. So I'm more than willing to let Austria just die in a fire here. Oh, you brought in Salzburg as well, okay. And you retreated because you lost. Excellent. Sort of. That's the only one I could convert. Okay. Well then. Um, let's see how these forts know. I just said I couldn't convert anything else. Oh, rebels. Where? Iraqi separatists. Yeah, okay, we're gonna deal with that. Let's get our troops down in this direction then. Under the one leader we didn't exploit anywhere else. Da, 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 you can probably march over here. Siege province just takes a while. There we go. Surrender. Uh, is that a fort? No. Uh, right, we also want to get war participation, don't we? So, where are you going? Unpausing that would kind of help. See, you are just returning. Um, dang it. Okay, in that case, turn around. There we go. We take the ports. Let Austria fight the battles. We'll take the forts. Ultimately, even if I didn't get war participation, I doubt they'll actually give me anything. It is just what they do. I'm so not used to the AI giving me stuff that I'm kind of counting on it. stack away before I get there. No, they didn't actually. Cool.
You're putting all your friends on this. Dang it, you're gonna stack wipe. Okay, never mind then. The only 22% participation, we probably won't secure anything, but yeah, we'll see. Troops. Direct rebellion. Might as well send in the reinforcements. Oh yeah, I forgot the uh, New World Rebellion. Separatists, very good. So let's return up to this part of the world. Let's see now. Okay, so first of all, uh, no, don't renew that. Manufactories, this changes everything, and we gain a ton of points. Yes! So it's gonna spawn where? Zaragoza. Lovely. Just quickly verify that. Let's see, institution, manufactories, spawned here, perfect. And of course, as immediately you can see, starting to develop in quite a few places. And it's gonna have an atrocious cost, which is okay. <laughs> we have plenty of money. So yeah, we're gonna just wait until this ticks up in all adjacent or all these provinces. How many how long will that take? Uh, 54. Okay. Hopefully I have enough manufacturers to actually uh, hit the button then. We'll see. But it also happened within our borders, which is excellent. That's more Diplo points. That means more future Romans. Uh, do we have any other adjacent ones? No. Do we have any other very, very cheap ones? Sutherland. Yeah, why not? Um. Where is this one? here. Where are you? Well, there. Okay. Um, by, oh, yeah, Jason by C. Oh cool. oh, cool. So that's actually okay. Jason by C. And that means you are adjacent by C too. Yeah, that's okay then. Um, are there any other very cheap ones? Really around, they're not quite as cheap. And they don't have the adjacency yet. So the question becomes, do I want to prepare? Because I know I'm going to lose, as far as I can tell it at least, uh, I'm going to lose all these as accepted cultures, the, cut, the uh, union. 
So, do I want to switch out the Catalan and uh, Castilian ones? Well, these are fairly cheap. Let's do that at least. Uh, the culture flips over in Italy aren't done yet. I would really like to, to turn all those into proper Romans. But we'll see. I'll, I'll wait. Wait for the discounts. Let's see. We're now sieging down all four provinces. Yeah, perfect. Emingen and Ulm are probably secured by others. Yep. Yeah. It's not really a concern that either. The sad thing, of course, is that uh, we won't be able to get anything here, I think. There we go, Badenfell. So I need this to fall before that. Yeah, if... So here's the thing. If Baden falls first, Baden will be in a position to surrender. Um, uh, otherwise, if uh, Lotharingen falls first, Lorraine will separate peace and we won't gain a darn thing. And that is my assumption of how this is going to go. Syrian independence next. Okay. It's gonna fire, so. Um. Let's improve relations with the Pope. Well, it's purely strategic because we're gonna be at war with him pretty soon. And uh, once that starts, we want his opinion to be as high as possible, so that we won't fall into the uh, uh, little chasm of uh, of um, excommunication wars. Scandinavia declared war on Sweden. Oh, okay. Orland remains. Okay, I thought Sweden was good and dead already. Okay. I guess I need to go over there and save you next. Poor subjects are knitting their nations together. They are, but uh, not nearly fast enough. Have I actually gotten all the colonial regions? Did I miss one? Clean my Spain. No, we have all the regions. Uh, that's good at least. I'll accept that one. Um, I assume that these have been set. Yeah, someone has settled there. That usually happens. Yeah, that's claimed by Portugal, so if we go there, we're not going to have it. no end of trouble. Do 
Do we have a truce with these guys? We don't, so they're probably gonna be the next, yes, so... Settling there... Would be a tactical choice, we still want to fight this war first, so... Try to quell his rebellions... So far as we can, and we'll see where we can go from there. Let's see now, that should have been marked the end of the Centers of Reformation. It should have. I thought they disappeared in 1650. Or is it just a conversion effect that stops? I mean, they, they were converting something down here. Okay, so the centers remain, but they can't convert anything anymore. It looks like. Um, I'm gonna wait a bit with taking that idea. I'm gonna get so many separatists over there. Ugh. That's fine, though. We'll succeed. We're just waiting for these sieges to fall, and we'll see what happens. I really don't, don't, don't know what Austria is planning here. I could be planning something incredibly naughty. Uh, we got more mercantilism. There goes Lothringen. Uh, so they might quickly need a separate piece. I don't know. We'll see. For now, though, time for a break, I think. Thank you for watching.